7-Eleven Come rich, I never forget it I bought the drugs and the women at 7 He's feeling I woke up in heaven Look out, Yagami-san. One of the leaders from the Kizos gang brought his men to come after you. And you know what they did. Uh, <coughs> they beat my friend black and blue. All because he said he might, might have seen you. Please, is there anything you can do to help? Crap, what do I do? Gang leader. Levels on the same these moments. In order to reduce this, you must either defeat those leaders or wait for some time to pass. Alright. Oh. We want the purple. Yeah, I got me something new. Ah. There's the man I've been looking for. Uh, so, Koga, being the lazy motherfucker that he is, asked me to kick your ass. But, regardless of the reason, I'd be happy to fight you either way. Man, I can go on like this forever. Why don't we catch up with our fist instead? All right, Bart Kwan. Oh, this beat, though. Get out of here, dog. Yeah, I got coming right up power. Kneecaps. Pink. Pow. Pink. Pink. Down, Honda. Jeez. Oh, 
y'all, man. Y'all let this nigga be my ass. He just disappeared. I turned this nigga to a force ghost. Sana's child. Hey, yagami san. What are you up to today? <coughs> well, thinking about you. What, really? <coughs> Actually, I was thinking about you too. What a coincidence. I guess great minds think of life. <coughs> mm. Mm -hmm. I guess they do. What are you up to, Sada Chan? About to, I'm about to beat up meet with some agency staff. Uh, apparently, they want to discuss some things with me. Song-related things, I hope. I'm not sure. They just, they just called to ask if I could come and answer some questions. Oh. They sounded more serious than usual, so I'm not sure what to think. Hopefully, it's nothing too crazy. Oh, it's about me. Oh, I got a new message. Do you have a moment, Yagami me, me son? Uh, I wanted to talk to you about my agency. Uh, sure. <coughs> okay, sorry, I keep bothering you. I'm supposed to be protecting him. Oh, I know. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. Are you Azuka Atugus? Mm. I am. Uh, who are you? I'm Yagami. Ginta Sensei asked me to look after you today. Oh, Yagami san. Uh, yes. Ginta Sensei did mention you. Uh, well, nice to meet you. <clears throat> Is your daughter around? Mm -hmm. Karen, uh, you didn't see her? Yeah. No, uh, I didn't. Mm -hmm. Really? She, she has to, she was just here a second ago. I just, I, I got so focused on the clothes, I guess I didn't realize. Is she lost? That's not good. Uh, she's an easy target for the husband if she's alone. What should I do? I'll go look for her. Stay here. N in case she comes back. Okay. Maybe someone around here saw something. I should ask. It's funny I got. Sorry. No worries. I just got here too. What should I get? Um, get over to triple joint. So I actually have something. What? Really? Yeah. Check this out. Oh, wow. Uh, thanks. I do like it. Well, I'm happy you were thinking of me. It doesn't really fit my style. That. Doesn't really fit your style, does it? <laughs> to be honest, actually, but that doesn't mean it isn't bad. I thought it looked good on you. Well, then I'll have to try it out sometimes. I know it was a little bit over the top. Ah, fuck. By the way, Sonachan, uh, you said you wanted to talk to me about something? Hi. I do, but uh, <laughs> why don't we go out? have a little fun first. I need to clear my head for a bit. Then <coughs> that could be arranged. Now, where should we go? Uh, let's try the batting cage this time. How about the batting cage center? It's pretty good stretch for me. Oh, sounds good. I've actually never been to one. 
Perfect. Then I'll let you. Then let's get going. She's going to beat my ass in this. <laughs> so, this is what a batting center looks like? Wow, it's not, not as sketchy as I thought. It'll be. Hope I can actually hit the ball. Why don't I show you how it's done? <laughs> oh, go for it. I, now's my chance to impress her. Better not struck out. Well, a swing bat. That's it. All right, can you come over to Yes. Katobas. <laughs> See is moving, I hate that. Ah. Damn it. Damn it. Jeez. Ah. Oh. Are you feeling under the weather, baby? Not so much. It's just I'm not always like this. Don't worry. We all have those days. So just play darts. Now, Sada Chan, before we get started on our talk, why don't we head over to my place? That way the public won't be all up in our business. Hi. Sure. I'll take you up on that. I don't know if me, but a little butt poking out. I still never went back to that gambling spot. All right, let's hear what Anachan has to say. So, what's been on your mind? Um, yeah. My talent is he recently received a photo of us taken right in front of your office. What? See, I said that before the letters. What? Why would anyone do that? I have no idea. The center didn't leave a name. What they, what did they leave? I mean, what they did leave was a letter basically trying to prove I was violating the no dating policy with you. Damn, I can't believe I let this happen. Whoever did this must seriously mess up, must be seriously messed up in the head. I know, my manager nearly lost it. Told me if I really wanted to be a professional, I'd have to stop engaging in un unprofessional relationships. In other words, stop seeing me. Right. Hi. That would seem to be the case. I can't stand the idea of not being able to see you anymore. Especially because of some dumb rule. I know what you mean. But your manager already got tipped off by someone with a stick up their ass. So I'd rather not escalate things. Okay, so what should we do? Well, we should at least be careful for the time being to avoid any further misunderstandings. If anything, you keep, could keep on wearing the wig of yours that we can meet up undercover. So I heard you released a new CD. Has it reached triple platinum already? Haha, <laughs> I wish. Unfortunately, it's not even close. I'm just glad we didn't run into any issues getting it out there. It also seems like more and more people are getting into my music, aside from my regular fans. Well, that's always a plus. What about the new song? 
we were uh, talking about before. Is that on there too? Hi. No. But it's almost done. Sounds like everything is going pretty well for you. At least in this in this area yet. In this area. Yet somehow, uh, you seem troubled. Mm -hmm. Now that you mentioned, I kind of am. There's still a lot on my mind. I'm amazed you can still compose great music despite that. So this man. That's actually what's motivating me right now. When I think about my worries and fears, it flows right into my my songs. It's like it's like you're channeling it straight from your heart. That's some talent you got there. I know we barely just met, yet it feels like I've known you for a really long time. So this man. Now that you mention it, I feel the same way. We've been hanging out together for a while now. And even though we're 15 years apart, I hardly even notice most of the time. <laughs> what a couple of oddballs we are. <laughs> that seems true. Sanachan, do you consider me a friend? Well, of course I consider you a friend, but you're also more than just that. I respect you, Yagami san. You're a man that I can rely on. Is that all? Mm. I wasn't done, you know. Why did you have to go and say that? Sorry. Uh, it kind of slipped out of on its own. Then, uh, what am I to you? <clears throat> I see you as someone special. I think of you as more than just a friend. Or someone special to me. Someone special. Yeah. Are you okay with that? Of course! In fact, that makes me very happy. Because you're... Because you're special to me as well. Okay, uh... Now, now I'm getting a little embarrassed. That's all we have time for today. Yagami-san. Do you remember when I said there was someone I wanted to be with? Mm. It's getting to the point where I can't hold back my feelings, no matter what the agency says. Hold your heart. Not too long ago, you said you that love was the power behind your music, right? You shouldn't hold back. <clears throat> wouldn't, your agency, wouldn't your agency only stand to lose it? If their policy impact impact the quality of your work, so this perhaps you're right. Ultimately, you should do what feels right for you, and I'll support you either way. Then what should I do? Then what should I do? I I doubt they'll bend the rules just for me. Uh, you won't know until you try. Why not talk it over with your manager? Easier said than done. I wouldn't even know where to begin. Uh, let's see. Uh, what about the song you wrote? Why don't you start with the song you wrote? Wouldn't that prove that you're really what's really important? Mm -hmm. My song? Yeah. Aren't you writing a song that describes the this exact situation. It's all about your worries and fears regarding love, right? Why not have him listen to it then? The music has the power to move people's hearts. Just like, just look at all over your fan. Look, just look at all of your fans. Maybe it'll work on your manager too. You think so? I do. But you should take some time to figure it out for yourself doesn't have to be right away. Hi. Okay. Thanks for listening, Yagami-san. <clears throat> Thank you for the coffee. You don't have the shits, ma. Should I rinse out the cup? Nah. Just leave it in the sink. Mm -hmm. Got it. Oh! And I noticed you still have some leftover ingredients for, for curry. Uh, no, Yagami-san. If you're hungry, I can make some. I can make you some. Some more. Would you like that? I would love it. As long as it's not too much trouble. Hi. 
Not at all. You just leave the cooking to me. <coughs> hmm. Ha. Ah. I'm all out of mirin. Shall I go out and get some? Yeah. You stay seated, mister. This is my way of showing my appreciation for all the times you helped me. So sit back and relax. Hey. You won't hear me complaining. <laughs> I could use a break. Hi. Good. Then I'll be heading to the convenience store. Be back in a little bit. Put on your wig. Getting kind of late. Why should be taking her so long? I guess it didn't hurt to check. Sanachan! 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 Sana